Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medico's Hub. In this lecture, I am going to discuss the dangerous area of a scalp. Now, what is dangerous area of a scalp? We have discussed the various layers of a scalp in previous lectures. We know that this layer is of skin. This is of connective tissue which is also known as superficial fascia. The third layer is of aponeurosis that is epicranial aponeurosis which along with occipital frontalis muscle is known as deep fascia. Then this layer is of loose areolar connective tissue and the lowermost layer is of pericranium. This is cranial bone and this is dura mater. This is superior sagittal sinus. And these are emissary veins. So, loose areolar connective tissue provides an easy assist for craniofacial and neurosurgeries. Now, this loose areolar connective tissue also provides the plane for separation between the above three layers and the pericranium. In a scalping, a scalp is removed through this layer only. But it is also important that it possesses the emissary veins. Emissary veins passes through it and via this emissary veins, the infection in the upper layers can easily enter the cranium. So this is known as dangerous area of a scalp. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.